Hello friends, my name is Victor and welcome to my channel Opera et Labora. As you see in my background, I'm at my parents' home again. That's mostly because I was traveling last week and I thought instead of uploading another video with me playing the harp, why not sharing my experiences from my travel with you? So, enjoy the video! Hello friends! My name is Victor and welcome to Bayreuth! Bayreuth is a small city with roughly 70,000 inhabitants, located in northern Bavaria, Germany. It is most known for its rich culture and history, which was formed mainly by Princess Wilhelmina of Prussia in the 18th century and later by artists like Richard Wagner, Franz Liszt and Jean Paul. The first site I'm showing you is the Margravia Opera House. It is one of the biggest and best preserved Baroque opera houses in the world and has been added to the UNESCO World Heritage List in 2012. Since then it's closed for extensive refurbishment, a process which will take about four years to complete. These stairs lead to the places of the Margraves of Bayreuth. And this screen shows how the interior looked like. As now it's just a construction site, I am showing you some pictures as I've been there already in 2009, before the renovation started. Here we are at the piano manufacturer of Steingreber & Söhne. It is a family-owned business, which produces upright and grand pianos. The founder of the company, Eduard Steingreber, was permitted to accompany Franz Liszt on his concert tours, where he looked after the pianos that Liszt demolished at his performances. He later supplied pianos to the Wagner family and to the Bayreuther Festspiele. Here I even discovered a Beckmesser harp, which has been commissioned by Wagner for his opera Die Meistersinger von Nürnberg. This instrument, though, was built in France. Now I am on the way to the Hofgarten, a park in the middle of the old town.
how times have changed. Back in 2009, this pretty lady was wearing a bra. Now I'm heading towards Richard Wagner's house. Here I am at Wagner's house and apparently every important building must be under construction this summer. Wagner's grave. After he died in Venice, he was brought back to Bayreuth. His dog's grave, he even carved the text on the stone. As I'm coming back to Wagner, anyways, I'd like to now introduce you to his father-in-law, Franz Liszt. As they were neighbors, it almost literally needs just a jump to the other side of the street to visit his home, which is a museum as well. As I actually came to Bayreuth to see the general rehearsals at the Festspielhaus, I really had to leave fast. Especially because there is no place on earth filled with operatic street names like Bayreuth and I had to take photos. While doing this, I stumbled over this house. It says, German house on German land, may God save you with a strong hand. Well, the story of the cultural center Bayreuth would be incomplete without Wagner's anti-Semitism and Bayreuth's state of mind, which were perfect fits back then. Hitler loved the musical and theoretical works of his composer, who died exactly 50 years before he came to power. Being a close friend to Wagner's daughter-in-law, Winifred Wagner, even helped him enter the group of the rich and powerful. He has planned to establish Bayreuth and Wagner's Opera House as a sanctuary of Germaness, where waves of pilgrims in search of their German identity would find it through his opera. Luckily, those plans have never been carried out. The Wagner family, which still runs the festival, has put some efforts to make up for the mistakes of the past. I found an exposition about Jewish musicians right next to the Festspielhaus, which displays the hardships they have gone through. I always needed a big balcony to talk to my people. Here we have some last impressions of my visit. So, that is it! I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did so, make sure to give me a thumbs up to subscribe to my channel because I'm uploading a video every week. Next week I will be on schedule and 
uploading another video with me playing the harp. Also, make sure to check out my social media, you will find the links below. So, see you next week. I wish you a pleasant evening and all the best. Cheers! <laughs>